Hey YouTube, this is Mr. King Loom, and today I have for you a Star Pack 2014 box. Now, I know this is probably, uh, this could be, well, I don't know, maybe one of the worst products this year, but uh, it's a lot, certainly a lot better than last year's Star Pack, and actually has a few things that I, well, I'll be honest, quite a lot of things that I don't have actually. It contains the Nordic Gods, uh, uh, Maestro, Photon Purple Operative, Thunder and Dragon. So I thought, uh, why not? I might as well. I'll just I'll pick one of these up. Well, actually, it has quite, it has all of the symphony cards, which I don't have because I actually never got the uh, never got the uh, starter deck. So this will probably be a quicker opening, but oh well, because there's uh, three cards in each pack. So here we go, and we have Gaga Gardener, Shoptopus, and Morphin Jar number two. I understand why they did this concept, but it's not exactly the best. And oh, we have Melody, the base gin. So I've already got one of the gin cards. Oh, number seven. Huh. Ironic. That's so. Uh, that's the only n number secret I've ever pulled. <laughs> Odd to see that in common. Uh, Magical merchant and uh, number C thirty nine Toby Ray. So now uh, that's been released as a star. As it's star for just like the previous. Uh... Oh, Tin Goldfish. Actually, I think that's quite good. Uh, that's quite a nice reprint. Uh, ZW Unicorn Spear and another another gin. I'm trying to get from as quick as I can, but uh, may I? Photon Lizard. Actually, I think Photon Lizard's not a bad, uh, not a bad Photon card actually. Oops, pack one so a different way. We have oh Tem Tempo. So we got all three of the other gins, but we haven't got the main one yet. And interestingly, we've all got Miss Starfoil so far. Oh, uh, there's one of the uh, Nordic Gods for Lord of the Azar. Oh, it's in Goldfish. Nice. Nice to have that as a star for. I'll probably put the decent commons at the back. I just need to clear this rubbish. Because I work with limited space, obviously, that's uh, that's a problem. Actually, uh, there we are. Put star for the decent commons there. Rocket Air Express, uh, number 25. So, yeah, not bad. Oh, there's Odin, uh, Father of the Azar. And we've got number 32, Shark Drake. I also remember pulling that from Galactic Overlord as well. Might have been the same tin, actually. Tin Goldfish. And there's Loki. So we've got oh, technically all three of the Nordic Gods, but it'd be nice to have all of them as a star foil. Morphing Jar, uh, Cross Attack, go, 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 go of them. Oh. There's number 32 again, uh, Bound Ones. I swear that's been reprinted a lot. Uh, there's. Melody. Oh, there we go. My stroke, the Symphony Gin. Well, there's my first one. So at least I've got one now. Oh, there's Photon Purple Operative as well in the next pack. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that doesn't help. Me dropping the pack on the floor. Oh, hey, photon purple optive in a star in a star foil. Hopefully, I can get my stroke from that. Oh, thunder and dragon. That was the other one I was after. Let's see, reflect. Oh, and there's thunder and dragon again. You know what? I'm actually going to put the decent. 
just uh, bear with me a second. I'm actually going to put the decent cards over here after all. I might as well. Uh, there we go. Uh, the reason I haven't put like uh, the numbers. The reason I haven't put the numbers in that pile is because I've uh, already got all the numbers in this set, so I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. Oh, fire and fresher. I'm not gonna uh, bother moving them over. Uh, number seven again. Two packs left on the left side, right side, sorry. Oh, twin fight on Lizard. Uh, I'm actually tempted, if I do build the farm deck, I might be tempted to run that, actually. It's not the... It's not the usual card that they use. Okay, I was wrong, there's actually five packs left on the uh, right-hand side. It's because I'm not used to, like, three cards. Then Tempo again. Photon Thrasher. Now let's see, what haven't we pulled? Uh, Photon Lizard again. Oop, oh, no. Nope. Guess that. Oh, there we go. Uh, four Lord of the Azar. So we've got two of the Nornic Gods in Starfall now. Now we just need Odin in Starfall. Uh, number 39, Utopia Ray. Okay, this is definitely the last pack on the right side. Ooh, oh, I knew I was forgetting something. Card, card, D's in this set. I knew I was forgetting something decent. <laughs> and we got Tem Tempo as well. Surprised I forgot about Card, Card, D. Okay, now we start off with the left side. Another Tem Tempo. Go, 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 go. Them. Yeah, this will probably be a longer a longer video, but there is a lot of packs. And uh, number seven. I'm actually running out of room. <laughs> so, if you see a cut in the video, that's probably because I need to actually clear some room. Oh, Photon Strike Bouncer. I forgot that was in there as well. <laughs> yeah, this is definitely a lot better than, uh, than the last set. I think the best set that was in the last star pack was, uh, let me think, what was the best one? Uh, it's probably that. <coughs> Sorry. Just trying to think. Uh, I think the best one in the last set was possibly Elemental Hero Escarado? Well, that's what I call it. You gotta go, 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 Bolt, I Iron. Sorry about that, uh, but like like I said, I uh, need to uh, clear my desk. Oh, uh, four, uh, another Symphony Gin. Because uh, the problem with uh, where I film my videos is that there's limited straight, uh, limited space, uh, so that causes a uh, does cause a problem when filming videos sometimes. Oh, come here, take over, Dragon. That's one I haven't got yet. Uh, same with Hammer Shark. Uh, uh, come here, take isn't bad. It's not well. It's good timing actually, due to the Cyber Dragon deck from Thrasher. But the problem, the problem I think is, is that they should have reprinted the. Uh, they should have reprinted the other one. Uh, come here, take Fortress Dragon. I think there's Loki again. I own. Yeah, I think they re should have reprinted that one because uh, it is in it is in the tin. But if I'm correct, five ton purple up to funds around dragon. Uh, I believe it got reprinted in the shooting star dragon tin, which is actually quite expensive these days. So I think that I think Konami should have done that actually because. In my mind, that card needs a reprint more than Chimeratech. Chimeratech. Oh, card, card D. Hmm. Whoops. 
If you heard a noise, that was actually my scissors hitting the ground. Next pack. Because I always have my scissors with me just in case. Just in case. Oh, there's Odin again. Unfortunately, I haven't got him in Starfoil yet. But there's still time. Same with Card Card D. Oh, oh, my stroke. Uh, Starfoil. I can't remember if I've got that yet in Starfoil, but. I'm not complaining. Let's come here attack again. Join goldfish. Nice. Go 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 giant. Uh, another symphony gin. <laughs> Deja vu. Oh, number twenty-five. And unicorn spear. Oh yeah. Like I said, uh, all the numbers have picked up already, so I'm not specifically bothered. Although it is funny to see number seven is common. Found strike bouncer and oh, speak of the devil, number twenty-five. <laughs> At least I can say I've got them in different rarity. Oh, there's Loki again. Laughing Truth Dragon, uh, Daybreaker. Oh, yeah, this is the problem with these packs because there's so little uh, reasoning. Okay, we've got three packs left, and I'm counting correctly this time. Zubaba Buster. Hammer Shark. And the last pack, what are we going to get? Card Card D, Thunder and Dragon. Uh, personally, I would want uh, Odin in Starfall. Melody, Tem Tempo. Oh, <laughs> Rocket Express. Well, we got two of the Melody cards. So, overall, not bad. I'm not going to flip for this, uh, the Starfalls because you would have seen most of them, but I'll just give you a quick flick through what I got. Oh wait, oh uh, sorry, oh yeah, I put the commons and star foils together. Uh, I think, uh, how many card card deeds did I get? I think I got two from the box. I think that's a good number. Got, uh, definitely got a decent amount. Well, <laughs> definitely got a decent amount of cards, that's for certain. So anyway, uh, like I said, it's a this is a cheaper opening, but I had a couple of cards I'm in, interested in the gin cards, pop Tiff, and card card D. But uh, overall, I I would say uh, this is a cheaper set, and if you've got all, if you've got like most of these, you probably don't need to get this set at all because it's it's a lot. It's a definitely a cheaper set than the other ones, so. But it was still nice to get some of these cards I don't have. Uh, so anyway, uh, there is the Star Pack 2014 box. And uh, I hope you've enjoyed this video. And this is Mr. King Liam saying bye YouTube.